Hello everybody, and welcome to my Pokemon Sword Let's Play Part 7, Episode 7, whatever. We are finally here to take on our first gym challenge. We're going to jump straight into the fray. Uh, I guess a mini quick team recap from the last episode. We have our, uh, still learning the Pokemon in their names. We have a Choodle, or otherwise known as Hayden, my son. He's level 13. Uh, his moves are... Tackle, Water Gun, and Bite. Then we have Grookey, uh, otherwise my son is Dante. He has the moves Scratch, Razor Leaf, Branch Poke, and Taunt. And then we have Levi, which is the Rookie D. He has Peck, Leer, Power Trip, Home Claws. And then we do have the Bundle B, which is uh, Thumper. He's Mud Slap, Quick Attack, Flail, and Mud Shot. And then we do have Sadie, which is our Yamper, which is Tackle, Tail Up, Nuzzle, and Bite. And that is all we have on our team for now. Again, I don't want to consist of te my team to consist of mostly a new Pokemon. Thumper is on here because I've never used him, and he was our first uh, Dynamax challenge. So, our Dynamax raid. But we are going to just jump straight into this. I am so excited to take on this gym. This first gym. I forget who the first typing is or what we're going up against. I don't know what's going to happen from here, but I am Moto stoked to be here. Let's do this. Oh, this Hop. Do we talk to him first? I can't wait for the first match. Pretty soon I'll have so many fans, I'll have to fight them off like Lee does. <laughs> Challenging Caleb, was it? Wasn't it? We must ask the gym challengers where the uniforms for all official events. The opening ceremony marks the beginning of the gym challenge, so you know what that means. That's right, I need you to get changed as well. Alright, I just head straight off to the changing room. Apparently we know where it is. I don't know where the changing room was, but apparently he did. Number 15, my lucky number. Plus 15 being the day I was born. Wonderful! You look sharp as a pin, and that 15 there, that really is the number for you. Now we're ready at last for the opening ceremony for this year's gym challenge. Alright. Uh, I'm excited. I'm excited. You can't tell the excitement from my face. I'm excited. Alright, the so gym challenge, we battle the gym leader, or are we battling multiple trainers? That's what I'm like... Wondering if that's what's gonna be, I don't know. Ladies and gentlemen, I am Rose, chairman of the Pokemon League. I know that everyone gathered here and everyone watching from home have all been waiting for this big moment. It is my pleasure to announce that finally, the Galar Region Gym Challenge will now begin. Yes, the Gym Challenge! Participants must defeat the eight gym leaders and gather the eight gym badges to prove their skills as a trainer. Only the most worthy will have the honor of challenging the greatest champion in history. Now, I would like to invite the gym leaders to show themselves. Is it always here that we have it? So we always come back to Moto Stoke when we want a gym badge? I'll have to see how this plays out. I'm I'm just <laughs> Oh, those are the gym leaders. Oh, the gym leader Whoa, that's what they look like. Yeah, I know the farmer. The, here's the grass type expert, Milo! The raging wave, it's the master of water types, Nessa! The ever burning man of fire, here comes the fire type veteran Kabu! The Galar Karate Prodigy. Nobody's better with fighting types than Bia. The master of fantastic theater is the charming fairy type Yuzo Opal. The hard rock crusher. Please welcome the rock type master Gordy. And last but not least, the tamer of dragons. It's Raihan, the top gym leader. Unfortunately, we're missing one, but... These are the gym leaders that we are in the Galar region are proud to call our own. Wait, who's missing? Oh, wait, we're missing Lee. Leon? Is it? But he's not a gym leader, he's the champion. Confused. <laughs> and now it's about time that we take to the field. <laughs> All right, then. <laughs> I missed it. My rose voice is off. What? Standing there on the pitch, 
in the stadium in front of everyone? That's really, there's really no words for it. But I can barely contain myself. My heart's racing. What's going on? You made it at last, Hop. And you too, Caleb. I guess they were just showing us off. So you're the two trainers our champion endorsed himself. Welcome. It's a delight to meet you. I'm Rose, of course. Oh, and what's this? I see you both already possess Dynamax bands. How wonderful. It seems you two have been led here by the guiding light of the wishing stars. By the way, it was my wonderful company that invited those Dynamax bands. Fans, you know? Oh, was that so hard? I dare say this year's gym challenge is looking to be an absolute blast. Very good, very good indeed. That means the whole Galar region is in for some excitement. The gym challenge is an excellent opportunity to show off your Dynamax Pokemon. Now, I'm terribly sorry, but there is some urgent business I must attend to, so I must be on my way. The best of luck to both of you. My Rose voice seems work, I can already tell. <laughs> The chairman certainly seems to be in high spirits. Now listen closely, you two. You both only just started on your path as trainers. If you want to win, you need to do more than just train your Pokemon. You need to train yourselves, too. Let's do it, Caleb. You know the gym challenge is a set order that you've got to visit the gyms in, right? The first is in Turfield, and to get there, we need to head to Route 3. Oh no, we have to head out, so I guess it's like a presentation area. The gym challenge is an event in which aspiring travel, trainers travel around the Galar region to try to collect gym badges from eight of its gyms. To earn a gym badge, you have to complete the gym's mission and also defeat its gym leader. That's easy. So do I have to see this guy first then? A gym challenger. Ah, but if you want to battle our leader, Kabu, you'll need to have earned a grass badge in Tuffield and a water badge in Holberry first. Okay, so I guess we're headed out. Pass through Route 3 and beyond to reach Turf Field next. Okay, so this is a good time to train our Pokemon to catch more. Challenge of Caleb. The chairman asked me to deliver this gift to you. The girl. I thought it was a dude at first. A gift. Such a wonderful thing from the chairman. Such a wonderful man. Ahem. <laughs> Excuse me. This gift is access to the flying taxi. They allow you to, in a word, fly. Kong, a flying taxi will travel you quickly back to areas you've already visited. Ah, oh, it just made this game a lot easier at the beginning, huh? Use the flying tech service. One of their well-trained Corviknight will have you zipping across the Galar region. Okay. Let's open up the menu with X. Okay. If it's alright, I'll read a segment from the flying taxi's user manual. Ahem. Press the X button and select the town map option to choose a place you'd like to... Okay. Anyway, next goal should be Turfield. Isn't that right, Caleb? When traveling to a new place, it's best to get there on your own two legs, don't you think? Well, yeah, because that'd be kind of cheap. Whoa. That's an onyx. I'm capturing this. It's mine now. Nope, it's just yelling at me. Okay. <laughs> Alright. So time to head down our way. Ah, finally get to walk away without having to talk with so many people. Oh, yep, we already looked through all here. Although, what's this? I didn't know this area was here. Whoa. Okay. Uh -huh. Or maybe I've not have gotten this way yesterday then? There's something here? Hup, 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 hup. Oh, TM. Payday! Nice! I have a meow, so that works. Oh, and look, somewhere I can fish. Alright, well, who's our first Pokemon up then? Come on. Yes! Ooh! I think I already caught one of you, didn't I? Go on, Hayden! <laughs> yeah, I already caught one of you. Oh well, just a little experience, I guess, why not? Hehe. <laughs> Bye, Magikarp! Yeah, Levi leveled up at least. Alright. This has great potential as a trainer on you, but it's too early. Please come back when you become the champion. Okay, apparently you're important when I'm important. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess that was just a random back road we could go down. Wasn't ready for all that. <laughs> um, let's see. This little gate opening, right? No. Who are you? Don't you wish people could use Pokemon moves too? I mean, I bet I could unleash an amazing Hyper Beam. That's kind of how I hop, bro, and you don't need to know that. Oh, hey, Pokeball. Silk Scarf. Nice. 
Okay, we didn't go this way last time. I'm Mojo Stoke in the town. I do my best every day and cheer on my favorite gym leaders. So you don't get tired of doing the things you love. Oh, I'm so gonna give all the gym leaders a fun personality. Once I get my new hairstyle, I'm gonna stop my, my Rotami at the Pokemon Terror to update my lead card. What's, what? What is this? Oh, is this the train station? Okay, it is. All right, well, we're not going to spend too much time here. Um, I think this is stuff I should look at off screen. But let's get on out of here now. Um, wait, do you guys give a move? You look like you might give me a move. No, I don't, I don't know about hopscotch. I'm good. Um, okay. Here we go. Here we go. Run. Run, 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 run. Hmm. Oh, ah. There you are! I've been waiting! Let's have a battle, you and me! We'll get in a bit of training! But why? Seriously? This is the moment when you play along and get act all pumped for battle. You gotta ask why, we should bother for training. Never make it through the gym challenge! Uh, fine. I knew you'd be up for it! We've gotta stay here than anyone else if you wanna save the spotlight from our rivals. Uh. <laughs> Hop, I win every time. Like, you don't learn. How many times are I gonna teach you this lesson, old man? Alright, Hayden, I know you can do it. Keep up, mate. This is our chance to see if you are up to the gym challenge. My chance? If I'm up for... Get him. Hit him with the stab. Hulu, use tackle. Okay. But well, we're gonna use water gun. Okay. Did a good amount of damage. Let's see how much bite does. We'll lose tackle again. And we're going with our bite. That did way more than water gun. <laughs> and we're no, no mercy. Hit him with the stab. Oh, hop, you really just did that. Crap baskets. Oh. Well, not sure if I hit. Ooh, got a crit. Oh, that's. Landing a critical hit like that? You're pretty tough when you get serious. I'm not even serious! Water gun! <laughs> this kid's a pain. Bye, Woo Woo. Oh, since you're always gonna have the weaker starter compared to mine, it's always gonna be starter versus starter now. Don't take her to level 15, Sadie grew to level 11, sweet. Sobble, yep. So since you're doing Sobble, we have Dante. What is he, what is he more accurate in? So he's more attack than special attack, correct? Yeah. So I think branch poke is a it's a physical move, right? Yeah, that physical physical. Oh, they're both physical. Okay, so that's kind of me then. So we'll swap them out. Sabo, huh? All right. Yep, super effective branch poke. Oh wait, I should use razor leaf. That's more power. Ow. But Branch Poke is so much more unique to this game. <laughs> Typical, should have known you'd mastered tight matchups. Of course I did. I I'm ending it with a razor leaf. You Sabo used pound, ow. And Dante used razor leaf. Game. Uh, hop, I'm so sorry, you're garbage. The only real hard rival I ever had was get for earlier gens. You got to send out Rookie D, huh? Um, he's pretty weak leveled all around, so I actually think Sadie might have her first battle, actually. Alright, go Sadie! Yep, yep. Back into a corner. You got it all wrong, mate. This would just make my victory all the better. Come on, mate! <laughs> yeah, you're level 12, I'm level 11. Ha! Too bad for you. I don't eat berries. Nuzzle! Opposing Rookity use Peck. And we use Nuzzle, the electric type move, to be super effective on it. Gotcha. And paralysis. Nice. Two more, huh? Hmm. Ooh. 
Okay, well, I'm electric type, so your pack still don't do none, and you only have a dark type move. So I wonder if we did... Is this physical? It is physical. I have an idea, then. Tell it. We're gonna end this in one final blow. Peck! Okay. Another tail whip to lower its defense one more time, and then we'll end it. Yeep, yeep, yeep. <laughs> see, if they whack their butt. It's more like butt whip than tail whip. You don't actually see a Pokemon whip its tail. Alright, and now we're going for the nuzzle attack, which is physical, and should end it in one more one hit. Yep. Perfect. <laughs> Defeated Pokemon Trainer Hop. Was well, that really good training? Looks like I better keep my god up, mate. <laughs> yeah. Thanks for the free money, that's for sure. Just what I expect from my rival. You know what? I'll even give you one of my lead cards. That's how good I think you did in that battle. Our gym challenge starts right now. From here, in Moto Stoke. Although the first gym leader will have to challenge in a town way far from out here. Still, you better believe I'm going to keep on winning my way to the championship match. Right? <laughs> Hello, Galar! Meet your next champion. From the sleepy town of Postwick, it's me, Hop! I think I just did it. My, did I do my Brit voice right? I need to work on my Brit voice. I feel like I need to work on my Brit voice. Um, alright. Route 3. Who's this dude? If your precious Pokemon get injured, don't forget to heal them up with a potion. And you need antidotes to fix up poison. Yeah, yeah, I remember the stock upon items. Yeah, 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 we already know. Okay. Ooh! Galare Zigzagoon! Perfect! For my Pokedex! Alright. Let's go with a tackle. He used Lick, what? Ooh. Really? Really? One Blick! Snarl, ow! Okay, another tackle. I'll go for one water gun, and that shouldn't kill it. Oh, great, we're paralyzed, we're lowering our accuracy. Cool, 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 cool. Alright, don't die. Yeah, you won't. And now, Pokeball. Go. Come on. Come on. Get in the ball. Yes. All right. Hate to go to level 14. Hate to protect. Okay. Say to go to level 12. Nice. Everyone's doing good. Zigzagoon, Zigzagoon's data will be added to the Pokedex. Galarian form. Tiny raccoon Pokemon. Its restlessness has its con constantly running around. It sees another Pokemon who will purposely run them in order to start a fight. Wow. He can chill out, though. Alright, what's... what was that? Uh, really? Okay, well, when I want to capture all of them, I worry about capturing all of them. Let us heal up. Okay, and do we still have... Yeah, we still have cherry berries. Really, the center is this far, so we're going to actually do a jump cut right here. Alright, and we're back. Woo! Did I get it in time? Oh, the pig! Okay, I just, I don't know why. I had to go capture it. I don't know. I've never had a Volpix on my team. Is this the fire type we want? Nah. It's Pokemon. It's going to be another fire type, but we're going to capture it anyway. Fight! Oh, okay. Let's say you're messing with that PP of mine. Right, one more water gun, unless the crit should not kill. Oh, now you get rid of my PP on my water gun. My guys fight me like that, though. I lowered it. Water gun again. And no crits. Pokeball go. Capture the Vulpix. Gotcha. All right. Thumper's already close to level 20. Thumper's our strongest member on our team. 
Nah, we are no nickname. Santa Box, second go to the box. Um, let us see. We have someone to challenge. Alright, I think we'll battle her and then end it from there. I think... Yeah, you're close. I think he might have... If it's the same levels, Grookey might evolve. So, honestly... Since we're already at the 20-minute mark here, time for to cut it. It's going to be a 20-minute episode. So, I think next episode we'll start off battling her and then making our way towards the gym challenge. Because I want to get the gym challenge. I thought it'd be in this episode, but I guess it's going to be in another one. Um, apparently, we have a new Pokemon to run into as well. So, uh, we'll get that all sorted out and figured out as we go along from that spot so thank you so much if you've watched this episode of pokemon sword let's play part seven if you can please look at like and comment down below it would really help out the channel and help me to get my videos out there more i'm fun and spontaneous and i want it to spread thank you again so much for watching and i hope you have a wonderful day and next time i'll see you when we jump